Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Natalie here back with a message for you guys. I hope everyone is doing well. So we're just going to be tapping into the message today, um, seeing what spirit has for the collective. Keep in mind, energies can be reversed. Time is fluid. Not everything will resonate for everyone out there, so please use your discernment. Also keep in mind that the genders of the tarot can be reversed, okay? Also the signs are just energy. Um, the signs aren't always... Basically, whatever sign you see in the card isn't always you or the person, okay? It's energy. Energy, people. Let's see what's going on with the collective Holy Spirit and angels. Also, if you needed a more personal reading, you're more than welcome to email me. My email is in the description box below for you down there, along with everything else you need to know. All right, let's get started. Let's see. Holy Spirit and angels, what's the message, please, for the collective right now? What they need to know okay moving relocating something here is moving okay picking up picking up all right crying over you okay someone may be noticing that something is moving forward and they're crying over you oh they couldn't give you a bad reputation okay so someone is mad and they're crying over you because they couldn't give you a bad reputation or you are being bullied online and it's not affecting anything about you. I'm hearing the internet is not connected to you. Yeah, yeah, you don't kiss, but you may have certain Aquarius placements. Aquarius rules the internet. Don't play internet games with an Aquarius, okay? So I don't know, maybe that could be significant or it could be their sign or something. But someone is very, like, karmic with it. Someone only uses the internet to harass, or stalk people, steal from people, um, spread gossip and rumors. They don't do it to read a book or nothing. They don't want to do that. They want to spend the World Wide Web's energy on you, pretty much. Or they do this to a lot of people. So I don't know, is this person mad because you're one of those people that will really get up and move on? Is that what's going on here? And you don't care? Yeah, bitterness and reverse. You don't care. It's like, it is what it is. I'm not kissing your butt. Nobody's kissing your butt over here just because you're slandering us. No one cares, okay? Yeah, you have no resentment or anger or hurtful words to say to this person because it's never that deep. All right, so someone is weird. They're trying to make something deeper than what it is, but the problem with this person is that um, this person also likes to beef on the internet too. That's another thing that I'm getting with this person. They're actually kind of weak, okay? They're like, it's... It's starting to get sad for this person. Like, it's, yeah, you're running away from this person. Or people run away from this person. People who don't run away from this person, I'm hearing, um, suffer financial loss. Okay? I haven't used this deck in a while, so we're going to use it. Clarify moving, Holy Spirit and Angel. So you're going to be, like, relocating... Or this has already happened or something you're gonna be celebrating or this could be like the energy of you moving up in some way shape or form what's moving for the collective ten of swords reverse moving up out of the ten of swords reverse what's crying over you ace of swords Why is this person crying over... I feel like this person is crying over the truth. This is a karmic air sign. Or they're mad because you're an air sign. That's also what I'm hearing. They're mad because you're more mental. You're not really into your feelings. Or you don't really care what people think about you. That's not the reason why... Yeah, 404 on the clock. It's like your um, your decisions are supported. Okay? In the spirit realm. And someone just feels like, oh no. You need to be bullied. What's cyber bully? Yeah, Nine of Pentacles reverse, bullied by a Nine of Pentacles reverse, or trying to, um, this is someone who tries to, um, say you're a Nine of Pentacles reverse, or they're trying to flip you around, make you feel, uh, like you're not independent or something, but that's them. There's also a group of people doing this, okay? What's bad reputation in the reverse? You can't give the collective a bad reputation if you live your life this way. Like, th these are complete bums on the internet trolling you. That's what I'm getting for this. Women and men, the whole group are just complete bums. They don't even want to be smart. 
they don't know anything or they claim that they know everything, but they really don't. They just try to find ways to argue with people on the internet so that they can sound smart. Yeah, it's one of those people. It's always these guys. What's the bad reputation in the reverse? Seven of Swords. Yeah, so someone is still running with what they think you are. Okay, no one cares. No one cares. Okay, Two of Swords. So you don't see them. Or they don't see that you're still not in that. I don't know what's wrong with this person. I think this person's like stupid or something. Yeah, they're doing this against a woman. They feel like they're not seeing any signs of you succeeding, but they know it's happening or it will happen eventually. But I feel like it. you're already, you're already out of the Ten of Swords. So they're like still running off with this bad reputation in the reverse though. It's in the reverse, so they're running off with, like, nothing. What's bitterness in the reverse? Somebody's weird. This is why I don't have time. Ten of Pentacles, or, Ten of Pentacles is here. I feel like this person is mad at you because, oh, you feel like you have money, you're happy. Um, you built it. Why wouldn't you be happy that you have it? Why don't you why wouldn't you be proud of something that you built? Yeah, the emperor. Someone did this on their own. I'm also getting you could have like a legacy handed down to you from an emperor or you have an emperor or you are this emperor. Okay? You have like masculine protection over you. So you have men you have men harassing you guys on the internet, right? But you have like a real man in your life. Okay? an actual one that protects you so what do you have to be like i'm trying to figure like what i feel like these people are trying to get you to be like afraid of something or like they want you to have a um, they want you to care about what people think about you pretty much yeah it's the king of swords reverse he like he's always running his mouth slandering you 707 yeah i feel like you have um two spirit guides that stand next to you one on each side that's what i just heard What's the Ten of Swords of Earth? You have two spirit guides on each side. You're alone, but you're not really alone. It's that type of energy. What's the Ten of Swords of Earth? Page of Cups. Yeah, it's like you... Okay, what's the Ace of Swords? Ten of Cups. Yeah, so you're happy? You have a family or... So either you've got women and men stalking you. It's like a masculine energy stalking you, but it could be women and men stalking you. But the entity that's stalking you is masculine, okay? And it's on the internet. It's not in your face. It would never, it would never be in your face. Never. They would never do it. Four of wands. Someone's trying to figure out who you're celebrating with if you're actually, um, so yeah, King of Pentacles reverse. It's like they're a hobo. They have nothing for themselves and they're trying to figure out if you have something for yourself. Why? What's the Nine of Pentacles reverse? Seven of Cups. Yeah, they're confused. They can stay confused because what? What's the Seven of Swords? They want you to like tell on yourself. Five of Pentacles. You want to know what I'm also getting for this too? It's like, um... Your spirit kind of dares this person. You kind of want this person to feel like you're alone and vulnerable. Just to lead them into the trap because they're what? A fool. They would do something stupid like that. They're very naive. Someone is weird. And they like to do magic on people. It's like you're not really like luring them in, but you like not defending yourself or you not running after them. It's like there's something they don't see about you. They know for sure that like you're not worried about your reputation, but are you alone? <laughs> the collective said, come and find out. We have the two of swords here. The hermit, yeah. The hermit. The collective is the hermit. And they know everything, so they are certified or liable to teach it to others. And they will. It's their purpose. Someone doesn't like that you're a teacher also. They don't like that your words matter and theirs don't. Someone is weird. When is this reading going to be over? Yeah, it's the King of Pentacles verse. Someone is 
someone wants money from you it, you have the ten of pentacles or like you have no reason to be bitter about whatever this man on the internet is doing because you're okay in life yeah queen of wands 10 10 on the clock so synchronistic too this person needs to go somewhere let's clarify the um the ten of swords in reverse let's talk about what they've done since they're so busy spreading rumors about you on the internet let's expose them we have strength here with the ten of swords reverse okay they're just being seen as weak because they attacked someone that was strong and a star. Like, what are they doing? Yeah, nine of wands. And then they try to put themselves up against you. They don't even care how they look when they do this. Someone doesn't even look in the mirror. What's the nine of pentacles reverse? They don't even see how they look when they do things. <clears throat> nine of swords reverse and the nine of pentacles. This is like a what are those what's that word called when i guess it's misogynist but i was getting something like worse than that like this is definitely like an abuser or something with the nine of uh cups or nine of pentacles reverse it kind of gives me energy where like they want you to have like identity problems because of you being cyber bullied okay this is what they do to everybody I guess you just eventually walked away, yeah. Queen of Pentacles with the Knight of Swords. I'm hearing like your protection is like you have whatever you have, you could back it up with words and the things you say you have, you could back it up. It's like a what you see is what you get type energy. I'm hearing you're an open book, Knight of Swords. What's the Seven of Swords? But this person's like, no, you're still a, you're still a whatever they're trying to call you. Eight of Pentacles reverse. It's not working though. Yeah, the Lovers is here. So yeah, the Moon reverse and the Page of Swords. So this person is watching you be in love too. That's what's coming out. If this person has such a bad reputation and no one likes them, how, how come they're in a relationship? is what's coming out here yeah the empress this is what they're seeing it's like they're looking the other way though they rather not look at you or something but it's like okay it is what it is then it's like i feel like the the feminine in this energy to be honest with you it's like she's seeing as it it's all love here yeah the lovers it came out again so it's like she's seeing like it's all love here so it's like not not really that serious someone here likes to make things deeper than what they are and they feel like whatever they do in the metaverse is real in reality okay so this is weird so this could be definitely a karmic aquarius because karmic aquarius is definitely love to meddle on the internet okay they love doing that stuff but high vibrational aquariuses will use it to learn you know study and you know be more woke but not this person what's the ten of pentacles Three of Swords reverse. <clears throat> there's the Queen of Swords. Yeah, I feel like this man though, there's a lot of feminines that are coming out here. I feel like this man attack a lot of feminines. Wheel of Fortune. And I'm hearing Whitney Houston's I'm Every Woman. So I feel like this is that type of energy where like this man is just mad. He's just mad at women, period, right now. He's mad that, like, all women... It's like all his exes have done this to him. <laughs> so it's like, I don't know. That's why I'm not really taking this seriously. It's like, this is a bozo. They're a clown. What's the uh, Ten of Cups? You're in a whole family over here. Eight of Swords reverse. Ace of Cups reverse. What's the Ace of Cups reverse and the Six of Wands? There was some sort of mental entrapment they were putting you in about relationships. I don't know who this is on the internet that thinks that they can influence your love life. That's That was never going to happen. Ever. 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 Because, yeah, because justice is always here. And justice is blind. Justice, justice don't really care about uh, people's past, really. They care about the issue at hand and is it just or not. And the situation at this point is not just. It doesn't make any sense. And it's not fair. 
so this person's mad at you because like i feel like they're throwing anger and resentment towards you but you're not really throwing it back and this is happening on the internet so i don't know who this is talking about but yeah the seven of cups i think it's them confused let's see what's the seven of cups because like yeah temperance reverse no they can't they're stuck six of swords reverse something about adversity they can't overcome adversity you know they can't overcome challenges and you know understand that what doesn't kill them makes them stronger they don't they don't conquer that okay they have never conquered that they feel like the more that they go through makes them a victim and makes them have every right to attack people and it's not meant it's not done to them to make them stronger yeah the ten of wands this person's very burdened because they're being rejected and I feel like a lot of things are coming to the light about this man or a woman. It could be women too doing this. What's the five of pentacles? We have the hangman with judgment. And there's something about this person being um, being put through, but being put through what you were put through. But I'm also getting energy where uh, you pass the test. Two of Wands, something about moving on to the next thing. Yeah, Two of Wands, moving came out first. I forgot about that. Something about 222. Two, two. You may see that a lot or you saw that number when something happened and that was confirmation for you. Tell me about the Hermit. I have to be careful with this reading because I kind of feel like they want me to like spy on the collective. But I feel like all it's telling me is that the collective is moving forward. Yeah, someone is divination spying. They're watching, not supposed to be watching. Page of Pentacles reverse. They're studying for the wrong reasons. They're studying something for the wrong reasons. They're using their smarts for bad instead of good. Page of Pentacles reverse. Yep, it's a man. They're, mad just, they're just getting rejected and they're all emotional. How come you keep catching me? How come every time I come back, you keep catching me? Something about the airwaves, the internet. So it's like an energy being sent through the internet. It's not being sent through like your neighborhood or anything like that. It's being sent or even your job or unless your job is on the internet. But even then, I feel like this is like, it's something about the way people can influence the way people see you on the internet and you do not care about it. And they really want you to care about this. They really want you to be um, obsessed with your image and how you look in the metaverse, okay? What's the King of Pentacles reverse? Injustice. Ace of Wands and give me one more. Yeah, five of swords reverse. This person's just mad. You got to move on. <laughs> you have to move on. I'm hearing you don't even have a choice. You have to move on. This is not, this doesn't suit you anymore. This is not your thing. A lot of you guys are in your 30s and 40s and they want you all on the internet like you're in your teen, teens and your turn in your 20s, your early 20s at that are uh, ranting and raving on the internet in a negative way or being in the energy of trying to defend yourself on the internet. There's some women out here too that try to um, defame you on the internet or like if your accounts, your accounts, something was locked on your account or something was happening to you on the internet and you're like, yeah, something's going on. It's like they knew, they knew how to do something, but it was for, it was for bad. It's like a cyber bully internet thug out here um, attacking people. Let's see. Like actually going out of their way attacking people. Not like, you know how people get into arguments on the internet? That's different. This is someone who will get into an argument over you, with you on the internet and then follow you forever. And like, you might not even know this person for some of you guys. They really need to get a life. 
I'm hearing this person is wearing the same clothes since the last time y'all argued. I don't know what that's about. I don't know what that's about, but yeah, that's what they're saying. Friendship. I understand that a friend in my life is for a reason. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. Indecision. I use my intuition in all aspects of life. So I am getting like, you're starting to know who your friends are and who they're not pretty much. I don't know. This person, I feel like someone wants you to be like, Press for friends or something. Okay? Helpless and hopeless. That's what this person is. They wanted you to be in the helpless, hopeless energy or something. Yeah, I'm also getting like someone is waiting for you to choose them or they're waiting for you to like... I don't know. I don't know what they want out of you guys. So I can't really like tell you. I don't know what they want from you. I just feel like you guys are minding your business. You guys don't deserve to be bothered like this. These people need to get a life. Find something to do. There's like tons of things to do on the internet. So many things to do on the internet. And they do this. We got failure. Exactly. Then we got loneliness. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. I know that I'm never alone. Remember what I said about you guys? um being lonely and stuff like that they want you to like care about being alone like come on we're grown these are grown men afraid of the dark mad that a woman is not afraid of the dark that's all this is grown men afraid of the dark i cannot what is this release give me one more I don't feel like you guys are helpless and hopeless. They did, I feel like that's their energy because they're getting impatient or they feel like something is too far away from them or something. I feel like if you feel like something is too far away from you, you need to like release something for good because this, this person is like a failure or something. Give me one more. They're literally just gonna drag you down with them. Yeah, change your focus. Or they're impatient with you because they're waiting for you to put your focus back onto them. Yeah, they're playing a game with you. They lost. This is not a game. No, seriously. It's something, someone feels like you take something like not seriously or you take something that is like a game. Some people may feel like you take your work like it's a game. Someone is going to spiritual or physical jail for a time out. Ooh, a spiritual narcissist. Okay. Yeah, so that's exactly what's going on here. They're either going to real jail or they're going to uh, spiritual jail. Where, like, you know, spirit guides, ancestors. See, the thing is, people act like spirits aren't around us all the time. They don't see what's going on. They see people... They see things that people don't see. They take it to spiritual court and they try to make sense out of it or they try to bring you good out of it or a blessing for going through it. Or, you know, they try to pull some strings for you or they try to take the people out for you. Or like, you don't know what spirit guides do for people. You don't know what angels do to work hard. Demons work hard. Why wouldn't angels? So I feel like this is just giving me energy where like, I don't know, this all has to do with like religion too. Someone doesn't believe in what you believe in. They feel like you're not really protected, okay. This says they come in peace. There could be someone in your life though, also that you know is for you. That could also be why friendship came out. So you do have good people around you, but you do have a distorted masculine around you. I'm also getting, you would have never known who was for you and, and not if you never ran into someone like this. Okay, because someone does the utmost. They're so disrespectful here to where like, you know that another person is definitely, you know, not disrespectful and they're your person. It's like someone is, they do just entirely too much. We have only one left surviving God's plan. I'm hearing you're put up, you're set aside for a certain job or a certain mission and people need to leave you alone for that. They need to leave you alone. This distorted masculine sees that you're obviously set aside for a specific reason to do a certain job and they still want to attack you. 
this could be a distorted mask and coming around for peace or something but it's only because they see you're the only one left standing it says south node not ready yet a divorce settlement someone's going through a divorce instead of asking why ask why not all bosses take losses someone feels like um they shouldn't be going through what they're going through they are going through um divorce and taking losses and they're like they can't they can't see themselves in the mirror because they're so distorted and they're not ready they're not ready yeah they're playing with forces they can't control or understand and they try to say you are playing with forces you can't control and understand but that's them if something isn't working, do something else. No need to keep repeating and expecting different results. I feel like someone keeps doing something repeatedly. But you can have rest here. No work is needed. This person is traveling to desperately beg others for help. And they pay friends and have no personality. Oh, wow. They pay for friends. They pay for everyone that is in their life. They have to like travel to desperately beg others for help or like th these are those narcissists out here who have to leave the country or they have to leave the city so they can get around certain people so that they can get new impressions you know they see it as like oh i'll just get a new i'll just start a whole new life somewhere else where everyone respects me and no one knows who i am that's that's this person's mindset because wherever this person is at it's like People may like run away from them or something. People don't like them. We have bigger, bit, bigger and better experiences are coming your way. You may not be able to see it, but great things are coming together for you. Trust the process. Let it unfold. Move forward knowing that all is working out just fine. So I'm also getting that like um, you are being comforted and protected as you go through something because ain't nothing bad going to happen to you. Like I said, this whole reading is all about a distant threat it's like never gonna touch you okay this yeah there no one's gonna do anything to you just people like to make it seem like you you care about that or something but you never really see it in the reality you're more of a reality type of person you only believe in things that you see half the time especially when it comes to threats okay so yeah what's meant to be yours is already making its way to you what's never yours is starting to flee from you with time, it would all make sense. Bear the confusion and focus on living fully in the present. Don't let your whole life be. I'll be happy when. Be happy now. Also, it's like, I don't know if you guys are in the energy of like, okay, I know what I deserve. So when's it coming? Right? It's like, just, <laughs> I don't know. It's just, just know that it's coming. Okay. It says, just because something is not happening right now doesn't mean that it will never happen. Divine timing is at play. Be patient and trust the process. Yeah. And it's also because they're freaking watching. And I can't tell you exactly when, where, and how something's going to happen for you. Okay? You guys are being stalked. What do you want me to do? All right? So, sure, guys, this reading. Hope this resonates for you. Hope uh, it made sense. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I will see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye.